Hey guys, what's up? Um, if I look all sweaty and weird, it's because it's so freaking hot today. Like, you guys, it's crazy. Anyways, today I am doing the rest of the TMI tag questions, which is from 26 to 50. Um, in the last TMI tag, I only did 1 through 23, and then I forgot to put 24 and 25 in. But I added it in one of my other vlogs, so go check those out. But yeah, today I am doing the TMI tag part 2, um, 26 through 30 questions. Okay? Let's begin. Question 26 is, what is the reason I joined YouTube? And the reason I joined YouTube is because um, who inspired me is Will and RJ channel 6... Chop, chop, chop. Shop 6, 8, 9. Um, and they just like, I saw their daily vlogs, they've been vlogging for a long time and um, they're just, you know, a gay couple doing normal things, being normal, you know, what everyone else is doing, you know, and that inspired me to start this channel uh, mainly for daily vlogs because I also want to show that, you know, what my life is going on right now as a young gay kid going through college and life and all that stuff. And also it's another reason because like right after high school, you know, for friends who I want to keep in contact with, if they want to see what's going on in my life, then they can watch my YouTube videos and see what's going on with me and, you know, catch up if they want. But yeah, that's the reason why I joined YouTube because to show the life of a gay young man going through life in college and to catch up with my friends if they want to see what my life has been going through and all that jazz, you know? Question 27 is, what are my fears? Um, I don't have like fears of like heights or spiders or snakes or like, I don't have a phobia. I'm not really like, I don't have like any fear of anything. But I mean like right now, what does scare me is like not knowing how to like move on forward in life like what to pursue or what to do in my life or how to move forward or stuff like that 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 doesn't like make me become fear of that but it just it worries me sometimes and it gets me scared of just like the future but I feel like sometimes you don't have to worry about that like you just you handle the obstacles that come along the way right when they um, you know what right when you face them but other than that I don't really have any fears 28. The last thing that made me cry. Um, the last thing that made me cry was I was watching a movie, but the thing is, I don't remember what movie. Oh my gosh. Um, it didn't it didn't make me cry, it just like it made me tear up. But yeah, I was watching a movie and it made me tear up a little. Question 29. Last time you said you love someone. The last time I said I love someone was a few hours ago. I just visited my grandma and I told her I was heading home and then I told her I was like bye Lola I'll see you later I love you la and then she's like bye I love you too I'll see you later I was like bye and I love you too and then that's it and that's how it actually went down question number 30 meaning behind your YouTube name the meaning behind my YouTube name um there is no meaning behind my YouTube name it's just that I want to start a YouTube channel really quick um you know get it up get it set and ready so I can post my videos and then um, I was like I need a name but like you know I didn't want to use my full name um, I thought I want to be like oh a catchy or something like that so then I just couldn't think of anything I was like what are nicknames that my friends call me or something like that and then that didn't work out so I was like you know what I'm just gonna do it my Instagram name which is the same but just it'll be Jamilio underscore familial that's my Instagram name and then I just chose that, I just removed the, the underscore, and that's the YouTube channel name. That's where the inspiration got. My Instagram name. 31, the last book I read. I don't read a lot of books, um, but the last book I listened to, which was audiobot.com, uh, was The Fault in Our Stars, obviously, you know, the famous John Green novel ever, and the most amazing book ever that I've ever listened to. Such an amazing book, if you haven't listened to it yet then um, go get it, either the hard copy or in audible.com and listen to The Fault in Our Stars because it's such an amazing book. Question number 32 is the book you are currently reading now. There is no books that I am reading now. 
The last person I talked to, question 34, is my cousin. Uh, no! The last person I talked to is my brother. I told my brother that I am filming this video today. Question 35 is the relationship between you and the last person you texted. The last person I texted is um, Sophia and she's my best friend. Y'all already know that. You've seen it in all my vlogs. So yeah, Sophia, best friend ever. Question 36 is what is your favorite food? Uh, my favorite food is, I mean, practically anything. Um, but maybe like Italian food, chipotle, arroz con pollo and enchiladas. Question 37, place you want to visit. I really want to go to Canada and London. Question 38 is last place you were. The last place where I was um, was at this juice place from my house called Robex. I went with my cousin. So good. I got a tropic kale smoothie. It's really good. Um, we were doing errands and on the way home we went to get smoothies. And that's the first time I've ever been there and it's really good. Question 39. Do you have a crush? Um, if I have a crush about like people around me like or people I've met then no but if it comes down to celebrity crushes, uh, yeah, everyone has a celebrity crush. I have a crush on Dylan O'Brien. I have a crush on Zac Efron, Nick Jonas, uh, Tyler Hecklin, Tyler Posley, uh, Colton Haynes. Last time I kissed someone was my grandmother also. I told her goodbye and I gave her a little kiss. I was like, I'll see you later, Grandma. And then I kissed her on the cheek for you. And the last time I was insulted, uh, when am I not insulted, is... Probably like maybe a few days ago by someone I don't know in the family. We're just like messing around and you know we throw jokes left and right and punches and all that jazz. So yeah. 42. Favorite type of sweet. Favorite flavor of sweet. My favorite flavor of sweet is blue. Um, I don't know if that makes sense, but like any candy that are blue or pink, those are my favorite flavors of sweets. Question number 43. What instruments do you play? I don't play instruments anymore, but I used to play the piano when I was a little kid a long time ago. And then a few years back, um, I used to play the drums. But right now I don't play any instruments. Um, I play pipes. I play the vocals of my voice. Question number 44. Favorite piece of jewelry? My favorite piece of jewelry all time, no matter hands down, is gonna be this Batman ring that I got literally maybe like 10 years ago or possibly 8 or just a really long time. This is my all time favorite ring ever. Question number 45. The last sport you played. The last sport I played was in senior year which I believe is going to be uh, tennis. And after that, that was the only sport I ever played. Question 46 is last song you sang. The last song I sang was My Cousin Heading Home and it was Work Bitch by <laughs> Britney Spears. Question 47. Favorite pickup line? Oh, I don't know. I don't like pickup lines. I find them cheesy. And right now I can't even think one of the top of my head. Did you fall from the sky? Because, wait, what? Is heaven missing? There's something about angels and heaven missing one because you're an angel. Do you have a mirror in your butt pocket? because I in your pants because I can see myself in your pants what I don't know I don't get pickup lines I don't like them they're weird so no I don't have a favorite pickup line and then question 48 says have you ever used it no I don't use pickup lines question 49 last time you hanged out with anyone my cousin and we hanged out today or yesterday when you're watching this um, and we went out you know we got some smoothies we got some lunch and just had a little blast in the hot, hot sun today. Question 50. Who would answer these questions next? Um, anyone who comes across this video, make this video, do a TMI tag, it'll be fine. Um, because Tyler Oakley said that when he got the Teen Choice Awards and he won one of the surfboards, he's like, you know, that he just started on the internet and, you know, just talking to a camera. Anyone can do this. You know, it'll be fun. You might 
find that it might be a cool new hobby, it might be something that you know, this is your passion, this is something you want to do in life. So, I want anyone who comes across this video to do the time, okay? That is my challenge to y'all alls. That's it for today's video. Oh my gosh, that was so much fun finishing the questions. I hope you enjoyed the video, because I know I did enjoy filming it. And it is really hot in my room, and the door is closed, and the window is closed, because I don't want any noise coming in or out, but all that stuff. But yeah, if you did enjoy the video, then please give it a thumbs up, only if you liked it. And I'll see you around next time, okay? Uh, I'll see you around-ish. Goodbye!